Um, we've got Ion Birmingham here, we've got Paul. Hello. Um, Hi, um, you're here with us for the long haul. Yes. And um, we're all watching, uh, leering over all of the counties. How has the count been for you guys so far? How have you guys been covering the count? Yeah, well, we've, um, you know, we've, we've picked up some interviews, picked up some photographs of um, some of the key seats that are going to be uh, disputed over the next few hours. Um, I guess there's not really much to report. We're trying to uh, sort of fill time, I guess. Um, with the uh, with the coverage, nothing's been announced yet. So um, yeah, eagerly anticipating the first result. Mm -hmm. And um, there's some of the seats up for debate, uh, potentially Birmingham, Erdington, Birmingham, Edge, Baston uh, being the two. Also, Birmingham, Paul Green with uh, Roger Godsey uh, yes. going independent. Um, how do how do you think this is all turning out? For what you've seen so far? Um, well, I think if the exit polls are anything to sort of go by, then it's not looking great for Labour. Um, I think there's an interesting battle with uh, with Godstiff um, and the Labour the Labour candidate that's standing there. I think Northfield as well is a is a is a key marginal. And that'd be interesting. I've, there's been a lot of campaigning over the last few weeks. Um, so yeah, I, I guess. If anything, if there's anything to go by, it doesn't look great for Labour. But you know, uh, I guess there's always a potential swing in when it's counted. Yeah, 100%. And I mean, we've been saying that we can see like, multiple people with various different hoodies, um, various different rosettes, uh, leering over in a particular constituencies. Um, and we were judging their body language earlier. I'm going to see if okay. we can do some body language analysis. Uh, Let me put my glasses back on and I'll... Uh, how, I'll how, do, how do we think people are looking... Um, looking happy, looking sad, looking slightly confused? I mean, I saw the, the, the one of the Brexit party uh, candidates with his feet up on one of the chairs earlier as I oh, walked nice. past. So he looked like he was having a good time, having a good nap. Uh, getting himself settled in for the evening. I think there's a few worried faces. There's a couple of a uh, couple of people that seem to be walking around but not doing much. Um, a lot of pacing, I think, might be one to uh, report back. Yeah, a lot of writing on clipboards as Lots well. I'm seeing from uh, yellow hoodies. It's a down popular here. spot for clipboards. Uh, the count. <laughs> Yeah, so we're here at the ICC um, chatting to Paul Stringer from I Am Birmingham who is uh, doing a lot of online stuff, you can follow them at um, www. Is it I Am Birmingham or is it I Am Beham I Am Birmingham .co .uk. You can find us, um, we're on Twitter at I Am Birmingham as well. Mm -hmm. um, we've got live election coverage, interviews, photos and, uh, and, and written written words all, uh, all cracking on all through the night until one of us falls asleep. That's brilliant. I'm hoping that you don't end up falling asleep uh, before the counts from Birmingham come in. It looks like they're a long way away though from uh, getting those first votes in. Okay. Well, I've not heard anything yet, but uh, there's certainly a lot of uh, a lot of tables still counting. So um, yeah, it could be in for quite a long ride. I think. Mm. Well, you'll be here with us for a long haul. We'll get yes. some updates from you later on. Thank you so much Thank for you. chatting with me, and we'll go back to Dean. Hi, Dean.